uh, let's uh, we're down to that lifeline. That lifeline has your guardian angels on it. On the left hand, that's this is one of the few times I read the left hand. So on the inside of the lifeline, on the left hand, where you have little lines, there you have a bunch of little lines that run parallel to the lifeline, and they'll come up, they'll touch on the lifeline, and there's a good timeline on that lifeline. About every uh, half an inch is about seven years, or about every eighth of an inch is about a year, and that line starts at in between your thumb and your index finger that's about age 10 that line goes off the back of your hand but there's not a lot of sense of me reading it. that's your childhood so uh, when you have the little lines that come up and they touch on the lifeline from the inside that is the age that you were when someone passed away someone that you had bonded with an aunt or an uncle cousins uh, parents siblings, old boyfriends, old girlfriends, kids in school, uh, if you were really close to them. So here's where your guardian angel, and they become your guardian angels, where that line touches. So here's where your guardian angels are. It makes a little line right across the lifeline. Besides the line that comes up from the inside, then it makes a little line right across the lifeline. So I have to read three lines that converge. Age 16, that's when someone passed away. That's your age when someone passed away. Age 17 and age 23. Now if you've had a personal visit from a guardian angel, it shows in your right hand. And it shows again with the line that comes from the inside. It's kind of a little parallel line but it jogs over and touches on the lifeline. So here's where I get visits at. Age 12, age 16. Ooh, that's right where somebody died. They might have come back to visit you after they died. I, I hope you believe in life after death because it shows in your hand. And then age 27. Those are personal visits.